all of us are Arjuns, caught in their own flesh, in their blood, in their tears, in their emotions, in their past, and being caught, we forget what our dharma is. Therefore, Bhagavad Gita is immortal. As long as Arjun lives within us, we will continue to need Krishna. That totality is not really a function of the activity that you are doing. That totality, had it been a function of making the sand castle, would disappear with the sand castle. you can be in the activity being total you can be in the activity what do you mean by being total with the activity yes. is the activity something outside of you are you and the activity any different hmm? being total means you are total not divided not limited not small and then you are in the activity that is surely in your hands. Being total is not in your hands, yes. but being divided is always in your hands. Who else is responsible for the division that you experience? You go to the sand castle and you say, this is a sand castle. That should give me... Huh? Yes, that should have three moves and that should give me pleasure and that I should be able to sell after two hours for 100 rupees. Do you see what is happening now? You are not going as a total unit into the activity. You are going as the divided one. Expect 
preparation for the future are you into it thinking that if a favorable result comes then yes no you may still have an agenda it's not a question of agenda what does the agenda mean to Castle. The sand castle, let's say itself is the agenda. I'm building a sand castle, hmm? and you do not build the sand castle half-heartedly. You are building it with all your might. But still, what does it mean to you? Is your intrinsic self-worth linked to the sand castle? When the sa- castle collapses, do you come crashing down along with it? That is what is meant by totality. So well pointed. You are not total with the activity. Total, you are in the Many, many years, just the same, a few diverts being total. That's 